This is the walk round video for the 2004 Abbey 217 GTS Vogue with lounger layout. The Abbey 217 GTS was a very rare layout. They only made them for a small number of years, but it was a very uh, usable uh, two berth arrangement. Um, this is an, a lounger layout final as well, which is even more rare. Uh, and it is the top of the Abbey range, uh, uh, being the Vogue, made by uh, the Swift Caravan Company. As you can see, it's in very good order on the outside. Alloy wheels with standard features. Double access points underneath the long uh, near side bed uh, to, to access the, the storage underneath. Comes with a gas barbecue point. Stabilised hitch to the front. Sorry, the sun's a little bit bright today, unusual for the UK. Down the offside, as you can see, it's all in very good order. Water inlet point, the flue system with the winter cover on it for the um, water heater. And again, this caravan had was one of the, the first with the new style GRP sides. So they're much easier to repair if they're ever damaged. The whole caravan is in very good order throughout. That's the VIN number. Uh, the electronic tagging system is used in the UK. Very useful. It's got the uh, window and the door and it has the stable door. A lot of the modern vans don't do this anymore. Uh, it's very good, particularly if you've got children or animals. Uh, but it's also very useful, uh, just as a couple. This is the, uh, I think, it's the lad I would use as a two berth. It's got the L-shaped seating at the front. Uh, lots and lots of cupboard space and easy access storage under the bed, so like a normal two berth. It has the very large offside drop window, together with a hecky skylight. They've got a lot of light and airiness in this caravan. It feels very large because of the way in which the beds are uh, 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 arranged. The kitchen unit is the L-shaped kitchen unit in this van, and this gives you a phenomenal amount of storage and workspace. Full-size cooker with three gas hobs and one mains electric one. Grill beneath oven beneath that and the pan storage beneath that. Very big cupboards underneath the sink unit with three separate cutlery areas. The larger Dometic electric and gas power fridge with a full width freezer unit and then another cupboard further along. So massive cupboard storage space in this van. Also, because of the lounger type layout, it's a very good area for the television. So you can put the television over here and there is 12 volt mains and aerial power points there. Above it, another big locker. At the side of it, fitted out cocktail cabinet. Another big locker over the sink. And then this very unusual storage area in the corner with the circular fold away door. And at the side of that, it's a dedicated microwave locker, slide away door, mains power point. So you can either use it for a microwave or not as you wish. Above the kitchen unit is the extraction unit. This will either uh, suck the air out on a two speed motor or blow cold air in again on a two speed motor. So uh, you can do either of those. That's the control unit over the door. And then the actual door to the shower area is offset. 